Oh boy, oh boy, they're back at it again with the leaks. Hello everybody, I'm the Battle Moon, and today we're going to be taking a look at some leaked footage for the next new operator. I'm not talking about a zombie, or any past leaks, I'm talking about Year 7 Season 2. Like, we're not even a month into this season, and it looks like the next operator has already been leaked. But before we get into all that juicy stuff, please take a moment to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. It really helps me out, and I really appreciate it. Plus, you'll be kept up to date with all the newest leaks. Now let's begin. For starters, I did not get this footage and I will leave a link to the original stuff down below, so please go check it out and support that lad. Now with that being said, let's take a look at this. It looks like the new operator is going to have a gadget called the ROU Projector System. It's this little ball that you can throw and it'll roll around and leave behind these walls of stuff. We don't really know what that stuff is, but we can theorize. That's what we're going to do. We're going to theorize. Now, this obviously isn't finished and we really have no idea what it could do, but we can take note of the fact that this new operator can actually walk through these smoke walls. They're not solid. They're not like hardcover and that's a good thing to know. Now, I have two ideas about what this could be. This is either going to be a really upgraded, just hardcore smoke grenade gadget or some kind of like one way hologram. Now this is just speculation, so take it with a grain of salt, but I feel like both these ideas could be pretty cool to see in game. With the smoke grenade, this operator could just throw it and have it bounce around and roll all throughout a site, obscuring enemies and allies alike, just causing massive confusion and a panic in the enemy team while they just sit tight and hold an angle or wait to push in on them. Like, I could already see this gadget and this operator being super defensive or super aggressive and just winning in both situations, like a really like unique and flexible operator. Now this would take some skill to know when and how to use it properly, but I like the idea. Especially since we really don't see smoke grenades in most matches. Like in the pro leagues, I mean yeah sure, but I can't remember the last time I saw a smoke grenade in a casual match. Plus, it'll help out your friendly neighborhood Glaz, which I always greatly appreciate. The other idea is that this is a one-way hologram, or a hologram that only this operator and their team could see through. Now, this really just depends on how sci-fi or advanced Ubisoft wants to get, and with hologram drones and laser turrets, it wouldn't surprise me if they just said, screw it, we're gonna have a hologram ball in the game. Anyways, they would throw this ball and these one-way holograms would pop up, allowing one team to see through it while the other team sees like a black wall or something like that, just something to obscure it. Now it's important to note that this wouldn't be cover. Both teams could still shoot and walk through it. So the enemy team could just spray and pray or hold an angle tight and still come out on top. But this operator's team would definitely have the advantage by, you know, being able to see through it and see where the enemies are moving or hiding or whatever. But this would still be really cool to see. I think tactically it could open up a ton of cool options and strats. Just make sure the ball is easily destroyed or taken out by other gadgets so it's not, you know, too broken or overpowered or anything like that. If this is even what it does anyways. I want to hear from you all. What do you think this gadget could be? Like, do you think it's a smoke grenade or a hologram? Or what do you think it could be? Like, what are your ideas? Go ahead and drop down a comment below and let's theorize and discuss this together. The gadget ain't just it. We actually got footage of a new weapon as well. A new weapon that this new operator could possibly bring with them into the siege. Now this leaked weapon is the ROF9, which appears to be a new assault rifle. It kind of looks like if you took Jackal's C7E, but put the drum mag from his PDW9 onto it. It looks like a hybrid of, of both his weapons. It looks kind of cool. It looks like the recoil isn't too bad, and we can see that it holds 31 rounds in its drum mag. Now these are pretty decent, and the weapon looks good, but without like solid stats and numbers, there's really not too much to say, other than it looks cool, and I'm always happy to see another weapon added to the game. Like, we need new weapons in Siege. They're amazing. We love that here on this channel. We love the new weapons. And that's going to be it for this video. I want to hear from you all. What do you think of this new gadget? What do you think of the ROF9? And what theories do you have for the next season of Siege? I don't know, so let me know down in the comments below. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel for even more amazing Rainbow Six Siege content. Also, check the description down below for a link to the Discord server where we talk all Siege all the time. I'm the Battlemoon, and I will see you in the next Siege.